Taylor, uh, can you tell the fans uh, the good news? Yeah, the good news is I'll be um, signing on for one more year at Fremantle Dockers next year. Coming off a rookie list and you're playing eight games this season, how have you seen this year for you? Yeah, it's been um, quite pleasing for myself. Um, yeah, made my debut earlier in the season and um, played a few games there and um, had a bit of time away, go back to Peel and um, yeah, work on the things I need to and come back in the side um, recently and yeah, hopefully keep improving each week. Can you describe the vibe you know, around the club, especially with you know, the group of young players that are coming through? Yeah, the vibe at the club's quite good. Um, each training session, each game, we're really going out there to improve improve each week. And um, yeah, young group with some really mature leaders in there that really help drive the energy at the club. And yeah, it's been really exciting um, this year as well. Who's been the biggest influence on your career so far during your time here and why? I'll tell you my doc coach, uh, Roger Hayden. He's been um, really helpful to me. Um, he always reviews my games with me from Peel and AFL as well. And always just giving little tips about on and off the field as well. So yeah, he's been a really big help towards me. There's a real young group down in defence. How you know encouraging is it that these are the guys you'll be building and sort of playing your football for the next couple of years? Yeah, quite a young group down there with Luke Ryan, Joel Hamling, Alex Pierce. Especially those two, Alex Pierce and Joel Hamling, um, quite young but really good leaders as well. Alex Pierce in the leadership group and Joel Hamling, um, yeah, great leader from Bulldogs, Premiership player. They're really great. And Michael Johnson on the weekend, um, yeah, one of the best backmen to play for Fremantle. Definitely passing on his knowledge and yeah, it's been really helpful playing for those guys. So two games left and obviously what can um, fans look forward to, not only these last two games but for next season as well? Yeah, hopefully the fans can look forward to um, us playing quality opposition in Geelong and Collingwood and yeah, all of us boys want to put our best foot forward against two quality teams. Next year we really want to start the year well and yeah, really put our best foot forward.